Alright guys, so what's up though? I'm finally back up today. Got a really quick um duck bow video I want to do. Really good for JP though, of course, we did get the new 4.10.0 update. It should be live in the game right now. There's a lot of little stuff that didn't kind of come up. Like there's like two things kind of came up the last few days on this update. I think it was like the new awakening tab, like when you automatically just left like um you know stuff like that you that you want. Not really what you want, but um little stuff like that again. Just so much of the girlfriend's update is a lot. I'm gonna we'll just go ahead and get started in the video because again, I shouldn't really take that long to go through everything. And it's all the new stuff. Of course, we have a new training. Um, the new training thing. I'm not training. I'm something for the new potential system. For the potential system that's new, um, of course, the automatic awakening tab. Um, something new as well. Right here with the items. Um, again, no, just a little all stuff. Of course, something new for like before you enter like a different type of map or I think any event in general. I'll tell you like I was like a map right there. Not really map, but uh, I'm I'm thinking wording here being wrong a little bit though. But of course, we did get lots of new stuff. Um, let me just go right here. Um, is it there? Let me just scroll through it. Let me see. Um, had it like right there, whatever. Um, but yeah, of course, we do get lots of stuff. Of course, um, right here, we do have a new banner that's actually live on JP right now. It's like, it's like all these like new LR bears have been showing up for the um, new Duncan, you know, explosive chain battle thing that's been going on together for JP. Again, it's like cool tournament, and of course, like, um, the OG Duncan Battlefield, um, all, like, um, 1.0, all in like the one though, of course. But, um, overall, though, the banners, I mean, the banners haven't been bad the last few days, um, though, of course. But again, though, um, I don't recommend something on the banner. This probably is like, just, I mean, the Goku Jones are fan are good. Uh, this Goku's pretty okay. No one really uses them anymore. Mythology is good. Brawl's like what's still one of the best support that means in the game. Um, Mr. Pan's okay. He's good. He's like, he's pretty good. He's okay. I mean, again, the banner's not like really good. Like, five is just summon art. I guess it's only like, how many is there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Three, ten. One, two, three, four. I guess nine. I, I'm sorry. I, I know. I'm probably tripping. One, two, three. Oh, okay. Hey, that was like that was something like that. It's eight features. It's been like this for the last few days for the new explosive chain mode. Though, of course, um, it should be again they're alive in the game and stuff like that. Again, though, I don't really recommend some of the banners. Um, um, I don't again, though, I don't really recommend some of these type of banners. They're just not really worth it in the long run. It has eight features. It's great, but no. Don't do it. <laughs> but of course, I never hear, of course, have um, Vegeta Blue ZZ info. I meant to kind of go over this maybe a little bit, um, hours and stuff like that. But again, the same thing for Robo and JP, same leader skill, no differences, no buffs, no exclusive versions like the Goku Black, you know, the stat thing better and stuff like that, of course. But, um, yeah, also with season the game as well, so it should be coming, I want to say around a few more hours, though, um, excuse my, I'm sorry, it's getting my nerves. Um, but yeah, again, it was just, um, season info and stuff like that, of course, he really is a crazy unit. I do, I uh, maybe having stuff like that, you know, free and stuff like that, whatever. I mean, no, don't want coins or whatever, because you don't want coins. I think it's like 200, I think, or... 150, or they used to do like you know 100 or whatever. I'm like, I feel like they just kind of discount coins sometimes, you know, with Dark Fest stuff like that. Like, you know, Dark Fest, I'm just not counting coins. Like, wait, this one 500, this one 200 or whatever. But, um, yeah, his EZA, he is an insane unit. I've used him before. I have him, I almost have him rainbowed. I just need one more to get him. But he is an insane unit. Trust me, guys, he is worth it in the long run. He's gonna be going to legendary Goku event. He's gonna be good, like, for like long events, during the battlefield. He's good for almost everything. Everything like LR refusions on um, crack and steroids. He's like that, but he does reduce damage. Um, he has a chance to do two attacks, goes with super attacks. Um, I have gotten like what four or five super attacks with him, just like non stop. And it's great, especially if you like equipment for him for when this comes out in global. Like, it's good to get, I want to say, two more months because the anniversary is when we get equipment and stuff like that. Again, though, great, awesome unit, broken as heck. I'm gonna go over him again. The one these eight info should be only saying a few more hours. Um, 16, I want to say. 14, okay, 14 more hours. I'm about to come up with this up, maybe it's going to be 13 more hours. Also on JP, we, of course, we got some new, a little minor, little update stuff right here. Um, also, I think this is like when you go on the map right now, you can see XTC Unit Rainbow, which is cool because, again, you can't see it before. Again, though, like, it's like before the potential system was first coming out. Um, I think the potential system, it was when, um, <coughs> Like two hours later, um, when the pit system and stuff like that was first coming out, um, we didn't like have like the 100% rainbow unit you know, on there. Um, you know, we had like the 100% again, like, the rainbow thing, like you know, stats and stuff like that. We had the rainbow star previously, but now, um, you know, we got like they updated and stuff like that. So, yeah, so we characters on the map right now, it kind of tells you, like, hey, now your character is rainbow. This is an image I just found from the book Reddit. Um, of course, Hydra's right here, I actually mentioned as well. There was like a bug on JP where the like, equipment and stuff like that was going up to 50, even though you can go up to 25 with it. And potentially higher, but again, that was kind of fixed. It was, um, I think level 27, even though, like, you know, it, it could go like, what, level 50, 60, 30, or whatever. 
Um, it can actually, it was actually bugged. So they fixed it and stuff like that for JP. Again, the Hydro Super Oh, and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, again, though, on this kind of, I mean, kind of messed up because I mean, I mean, for equipment, though, it can be kind of broken because you can't get, like, specific, you know, levels and stuff like that. Could be good, bad, maybe a good in-between, maybe not, who cares, but it's, um, overall, I want to say it's so good, though, of course. Um, I don't think what else um, is on here. So, yeah, um, this is just a really quick um, equipment bug. Um, there here, I want to say this new awakening tab for new update. Okay, this is all, we're, we're going to start getting the new update stuff. Um, right here, of course, is, like, when, you know, when you're, um, I think when you have, like, a dupe in a unit, or, you know, when you automatically, um, I think automatically, if you're doing the dupe, like, when you're going up the path, like, you know, going to the bottom left, or top left, whatever, bottom, no, top right or whatever, um, you got to, like, select a unit or whatever, and not select a unit, but you got, um, I think you have to select a dupe for you, um, like, you, I think automatically to put it in, um, so you don't have to, you know, go back for the tabs, um, I think, like, yeah, like, we have a tinder system stuff, I think. Um, then, of course, you know, when you unbreak a unit, you go, um, I think you can break them just again, which is kind of cool. Again, though, like, um, it's typical stuff again, though. Probably that's the end game to get a probably a better view of it. But, yeah, um, that's how it's going to be structured and stuff like that for um, that, of course. Um, but, again, like, when you feel, I think when you're feeling like a dupe, you'll automatically go off the path. Um, and then when you reverse it and stuff like that, it's a little bit more easier. You don't have to, over, you don't have to go back all the way to the reverse path. You can automatically reverse it in the potential system. So that's great. Um, way faster. Thank God. Now you got for the potential system. All you got to do is do Dragon Ball Legends. All you got to do is select all. Perfect. Then you can select all the equipment that you want. Um, all the, you know, path stuff like that. That would be so great and awesome. Uh, that's all you got to do. Like, do that with Legends. I mean, they did with Legends. Of course, they can do it with Dark and, of course. But yeah. The other way, like, when you select the tab and stuff like that, it'll tell you, um, you can select the, um, Again, like we feel like a dupe of this path. Um, as I would say, um, we feel like a dupe in, um, it would be like the proper notification, and you can reverse the reverse unit really easily. That's great, and that's awesome. Then, right here, I think is like the new tab. It'll automatically, like, when you, um, you know, when you try to awaken or Z awaken you or whatever, it'll automatically activate. So, you know, if you like, if you're from like SA, um, super attack, like just doing stuff like that, you can easily, 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 easily breathe, live it, breathe. Um, nice little sweet, work. Um, but yeah, um, we can also like you know it'll automatically select it. Like we automatically try to get a unit. Boom, right there. All you gotta do is press that Z awaken tab. Boom, there you go. So you don't have to do all that. Then right here, I think is um, okay. This is another example right here. What I'm talking about. It'll automatically, it'll automatically just select like the um tab and stuff like that for you. So yeah, so you don't have to go uh, right ahead and click it. Which is good though. I like that um, mentality. So you don't have to go back and forth and that stuff. Also, this is for the equipment, uh, not equipment, but um, for the new items, not items, but this is for the new items that are on JP right now. Um, I used to tap it and stuff like that, of course. Um, it should automatically like, re-tap it. Um, you can untap it because you know you had to, um, yeah, previously you had to untap this button to remove all your deep, uh, remove your equipment. I thought they opened like the two slots down here. I was really like, oh yeah, but no, talking about two guys, we're almost there. We're almost there, we're about two. Um, but yeah, like when you tap like the um item right here and stuff like that. When you tap it once, like on here, like if you like tap um put tap right, if you just tap it right here, then we tap it again right here. You can easily remove it. And right here, of course, for the events and stuff like that, you can easily just um right here tell you all the event info. Like for example, if you're trying to do like the Vegeta Blue event, for example. All you gotta do is come here and boom, that's it. That's all you gotta do. Um, you'll see like all the event info. It'll be it'll pop up just like this. We press that yellow button right here. Um, all, that's easy as heck. All you gotta do, and it'll show you like all the info and stuff like that, of course. Um, like for the event, it'll show you automatically just like all this stuff right here. Um, I'm just getting down. Um, okay, let me go get. Um, but yeah, like, oh, I'll show you like all its info and stuff like that for like all the units, awakenings and stuff like that, which should be pretty cool. But yeah, that's all I really want, really want to go though today. Again though, um. I also feel like for the new update, hopefully I got everything out as fast as I could. Um, but yeah, um, it's all like the new stuff for the new update though. Um, but yeah, it should be in the game live and stuff like that. I didn't, I was gonna kind of go over it. I mean, you know, just like just new stuff for JP. Um, right now, just video boost games and game hours. Um, again, though, he is in the same unit right there. Um, he's just crazy overall. So yeah, see you guys later though. Um, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day, great life, all the cool junk, all the info for global. This should be what. Around anniversary time slash July because they tend to do this type of stuff really early. Um, again, they'll probably like two months because you know after World Tournament, before World Tournament, don't confess whatever they always do up there. Or it could come today, tomorrow. They have pushes updates early on global before. I'm just saying. So yeah, see you guys later though. Again though, so.